All right, so today we have the B Max Mini PC. This one has 8 gigabyte of system RAM, 128 gigabyte of SSD M.2. This one runs the Intel Celeron N3450 up to 2.2 gigahertz uh, for USB, dual display, the support 4K, and much more. How are we doing everyone? My name is Dario from MediaBoxCNT.com here on the YouTube channel MediaBoxCNT Lab and today once again we got the BMAX great mini PC so if you're looking to upgrade home office second PC you don't want to use your personal computer to do your job well we have that perfect PC why because I will say 99% of the dev jobs today or whatever you do is being done mostly cloud-based but not only that how about a Plex server? And you can play all the movies, right? And your big TV, projector. How about a Cody server? Run Cody, Plex, Plex on, and an emulator. Now you can, great box to run an emulator. I want to show you what we get, right? And I show you how fast this thing boot up. Only takes a few seconds, so we're going to plug it in. And we go right away and we lock it into the Windows 10 Pro. All right. All right, so we're ready. Let's press power and the power is on so you guys can see how fast this thing starts to come up in a few seconds. All right, run password and it should come up in a second. We're going to check the C drive. And again, you can install what I showed you in the beginning. You can install another M.2, right? And put another 250 gigs, 500, 1 terabyte, whatever you want to install. And that will be your D drive. So that's perfect for the D drive. Yes, we add in. And the whole thing, what? Maybe, what, 15 seconds or whatever? So we have right over here. So let's click N2. And let's look the C drive. All right, so we see right there my PC, and we can see we can see now my C drive, uh, 128. Remember the it takes a little bit in the partition on Windows uh, 10 Pro. But let's take a look what we get. Let's make sure the Windows register version of window. So right away, we can see now is a gigabyte the system run. We can see it's running the Celeron, right? The N450, uh, and we can see the speed is running at, at top uh, right now. We It can go faster, and we can see it also has been and activated right there. Windows is activated. You have to remember that if you need to buy, if you build a PC and you need to buy Windows, it's almost like $128. So start off, this one already comes with the Windows. And let's start the browser. And perfect, all right, to hook up in a big screen. Oh, once again, run as a server. And if you see here, eh, it started right away. And only a few seconds. So if you need to browse or whatever, right, that will be perfect. And once again, if you need to run like 80s games, so that will be a real cool uh, mini PC for that. All right, guys, if you see only text. And the Windows, by the way, the installation of Windows is pre-installed. So what's going to happen? It's going to ask you what you are. All right, you're in your state, United States, what language you want, keyboard layout, and then some uh, privacy questions that will ask you. It's, it's like any other installation of Windows. Then create the account if you want to be online or offline, and it's done. After that, boom. The what I one thing I will recommend when you create the account, when it's all done, just go and force Windows update. Just leave it for an hour, come back later on, and the machine will be updated to the latest uh, Windows version. And you, die. you you can enjoy now your mini PC. All right, so once again, you're going to get one of these. Let me know. What are you going to be using one of these PC? What will be the the use for? In my case, I think it will be good for my uh, become an emulator. Uh, that's a good thing for me and for my wife at home office PC. All right, guys. I will leave the link right below this video so you can get one of the B-Max uh, mini PC right now. I'll see you next time. Bye.